Hey guys, for this video, mm, first thing I just want to let you guys know, I'm going to have some new stuff. I'm just waiting to set it all up, so going forward, the streams and the videos should, uh, the production value should be going up steadily. Anyway, I want to talk about the, the new Chill Bomb and the Milton Martinez uh, situation. Uh, so if you guys don't know, Nuge did this hill in in LA, and it was really gnarly. He bombed this hill, and uh, I would say that this was sort of one of sig one of the things that Nuge is remembered for. Um, not that his skate career is over, but certainly one of the craziest things that Nuge has has ever done. I mean, in 2016, they made this My War about it, uh, where they interview him, the whole shebang. It's got almost 3 million views. Uh, pretty crazy stuff, right? So let's check it out. Anyway, so so that's that's the hill bomb, very crazy. Okay. Anyway, so sometime in 2020, right, Milton decides that he's gonna bomb this hill as well. Okay, so he does it, and I mean, he, as far as we know at that point, he's the second person to do it in skateboarding. Right? There's there's rules on on how you do stuff once a trick has been done at a spot you're not supposed to repeat the trick if you're a professional skateboarder that is because then it's already been done you don't do the, the same tricks as other professional skateboarders at spots and then post them or whatever so because it's a hill bomb it's sort of like a gray area right because is bombing a hill even a trick or or is it a stunt I don't know. Does the difference matter? Who knows? My impression when I first saw this was, that's kind of fucked up. I don't know why he would post this. This was a big deal um, that, that Nuge did this hill. Tribute tricks are kind of a, a sticky situation where, I mean, is it is it cool to do a tribute trick? Is it not cool? I would say it really depends on your relationship to the person that you're doing the tribute trick Two, I don't know what Nuge's and Milton's relationship is. I have no idea. I'm not here to really speculate on that. Basically, I thought that this was inappropriate to post. Because no matter what, I mean, Milton did it easier, right? And I think there's a few reasons for that. Milton's like a next generation, extremely talented skateboarder. And, you know, prior to me seeing this, hypothetically, if you ask me, and I can say whatever I want now, of course, because hindsight is 2020. Can Milton do the the LA Hill bomb? And I'd be like, yeah, probably. I mean, I've seen other stuff that Milton can do. He can he can probably do that. Does that mean that he should post a video of him online doing it? I don't I don't think so. To me, it's obvious that that Milton made this look easier because. Once somebody has already done something, and this is going to be important, once somebody has already completed something and another person can see that it's possible, in this video, Nuge talks about the specific line that he took. So Nuge already was the first person to do this. He figured out the path you have to take to, to bomb this hill, and he's the one who, who put his ass on the line. He was the guinea pig, and he figured out how to do it. So for this dude to come in and sort of do something that's already been done and somebody else has already figured out, I think it's pointless. Like, totally go down it for fun. Um, he's that good of a skateboarder. He can do that. But why why post it? It accomplishes nothing. To me, it only reads in a, as an attempt to diminish what Nuge has already been has already accomplished. In my opinion, it sort of takes away from, from Nuge's accomplishment. And that was one of the biggest things that he's done in his career. That's one of the things that he's known for. Sometime later in 2020, right, Independent comes out with this huge thing where they do this ad and stuff and they take this epic photo of this hill that 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 Milton does. And 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 everybody was was freaking out about this i mean look at how they title it milton survives gnarliest hill bomb in san diego so here it is
There you have it. Okay, so when this dropped, so everyone was freaking out about this. They were like, oh my god, this is the gnarliest hill bomb of all time. Now, my my first impressions when I saw this were, yeah, that's crazy, but I don't think it's nearly as crazy as everybody everybody is making it out to be. And I wasn't hot on Milton to begin with because of the Nuge thing, to be honest. like I, I felt like that was a bit disrespectful, and I didn't care for it. So anyway, Independent makes this thing a big deal. Um, and then, I mean, we have this photo. They turn it turned it into an ad. Everybody in the comments, if you read the comments on the video, was losing their fucking mind. I think that the Baxter Hill is a, cr is a crazier hill to bomb. And the first reason why is, I mean, look at the, look at the street. It's pretty much a brand, brand new paved street compared to what Nuge was working with, which is some real crusty Los Angeles old, old ass pavement. And the other thing about it is this hill that Nuge does, it just goes straight down. There's no, there's no breaks. Yeah, it's shorter, but it's just straight down. The one that this legendary hill bomb that Milton does, I mean, oh, guys, I'm not saying it's not gnarly. It's not what I'm saying. I'm just comparing the two, okay? Because the, the reason I'm comparing them is because that one was Nuge's accomplishment, and this one is Milton's accomplishment. This one goes like this. So I think that this one is less gnarly because the, the pavement is much better, and you get to bottom out twice on your way down. Not saying it's not gnarly, I'm just comparing the two. This looks safer to me than what Nuge did. Anyway, that being said, I mean, we can argue about which one's gnarlier. Who cares? I mean, it's subjective. That's just my take on it. Now, this came out six weeks ago. Shaking off the car legs. That's what T-Funk titled this. If you can't tell, this is the same hill that, that Milton did in San Diego. So this is uh, Tristan Funkhauser and Pedro Delfino doing this hill. Now they did it with some beers. So what does this say? To me, this confirmed what I had originally thought, which is that I'm not sure how gnarly this is. Now, why did they do this like, and sort of present it in a way that was kind of disrespectful? I, I'm not sure. Maybe they felt similarly to the way that I did, that it wasn't that crazy and people made too big of a deal about it. Or maybe this has something to do with avenging Nuge a, a little bit. Could that be the case? I don't know. Um, but, I mean, T-Funk, Pedro Delfino, and Nuge are under the Baker Boys distribution umbrella. So, to some extent, as an outsider, the way that I understand it is they're kind of sort of on the same team kind of thing. I read this video, I mean, T-Funk did it twice, as pretty much just a, a fuck you to Milton Martinez. I could be looking too deep into this, but that's just how I see it. To me, they're diminishing Milton's accomplishment as the first person to go down that, as far as I know. They're diminishing Milton's accomplishment in in a similar way that Milton uh, diminished uh, Nuge's accomplishment by going down this hill. Only this is a much more poignant way of of doing it. Shaking off the car legs, drinking a beer. He did it twice. I think that says all all we need to know, right? After Milton did the the uh, the Baxter Hill in Los Angeles. GX1000 posts this. Uh, per Nuge's request, um, here is Sean and Pablo bombing Baxter Street in April of 2017. Okay, so they say they weren't doing it for the clip or to outdo anyone, but to enjoy the ride. 
which is kind of what I th thought was like, you know, that's the appropriate way to do it if you're going to bomb this hill. I mean, bomb whatever hill you want, but it doesn't mean you should post it if someone else has already done it, and that's one of their things. Okay, the, the intentions of this video is not to take away from Milton doing it. I don't know. I had promised Nuge I would show him, but I'd also promised Sean it would not be released as he didn't want the th thought of as guys that took out Nuge. I think enough time has passed, and it is now an appropriate time as ever to let it be seen. So, I don't know what Nuge is like as a person, obviously. I am 100% not at all connected in the skateboard industry whatsoever. So, I don't know how he feels about other people doing the same hill. This is just, like, me thinking about, like, sort of this skateboarding culture and, like, the do's and don'ts of skateboarding, just from my perspective. Um, and this, I think, was a much more respectful way of doing it basically how i interpret this is these guys said yeah we did the hill we recorded it but we had the good sense to not post it online because it's kind of inappropriate that's that's how it reads to me and turns out milton's actually the fourth fourth guy to do this hill as far as we know and you know these guys had the good sense to not post it online i think because they ans they understand that there's nothing to be gained from it so yeah, I mean that that I think a, a, about about wraps it up. Um, I just I appreciate these this approach to it, and I I don't think this video probably would have ever come out. I I doubt this video would have come out had Milton not posted himself doing it. To summarize my my opinion, we understand that this was a big part of of Nuge's career. This was one of the defining points of his career. To come along as the and to do it after he's already done it, Nuge already figured out how to do it. He laid the groundwork. He was the first guy to approach that hill and and to conquer it. To do it again, it's or to to post a video of you doing it after he's already done it. It's it's just it's not a cool thing to do. It's like okay, I mean you can't necessarily equate the two because I don't know is this a trick? Is bombing hill a trick or is it a stunt? Or is it something else? I don't really know. But imagine if <clears throat> we all know that, that Jaws is the first and only dude right now to have ever, ever done this stair set. Because it's totally absurd. Um, but yeah, imagine if somebody else came along after him and sort of also melon did the same exact thing, like did a melon or, or, or something, or just did an ollie. It would kind of be like, okay, like what's why god oh, that's sad that he did this in an asphalt yacht club hoodie what a tragic what a tragic period of time um anyway it's been done if somebody came along and did a kickflip or a 180 down it that would be a different story but to do the same exact thing and just bomb the hill again you know it doesn't do anything for me personally and i think that it's it's not really the, the right move, in my opinion. Anyway, that about covers uh, my my opinion. I, I'd be curious to know what your guys' opinions are because, you know, I don't really voice a lot of this stuff um, out loud. I don't have a lot of people to bounce my ideas off of. Um, I would be curious to get some other perspectives. And I mean, if you enjoy this sort of content, I would assume that maybe you think about skateboarding um a little bit more intensely than the average person, or I don't know why you're watching these. Maybe you just like the entertainment, but it doesn't matter. Um, I'd be curious to know what you guys what you guys think about the situation. Um, really, like hill bombing etiquette in in general. Like, what is okay? What's okay to do? And and what's not? I mean, I think that this was a pretty this was a pretty strong statement that said. Uh, these dudes are, are really not okay with, with what Milton did. And I think that it was kind of poetic justice. I, In my opinion, um, Milton got what he deserved. If I'm reading the situation correctly, which, you know, I could be completely wrong because I don't, I don't know any of these dudes. But, yeah. Uh, anyway, let me know what you guys think, as I said. And uh, I'll see you guys in the next video.